first film of the Heisei series from Toho was every bit as explosive and captivating as one could expect. Godzilla 1984, The Return of Godzilla, served as a direct sequel to Gojira 1954 and welcomed back the dark themes and of course political commentary that was no stranger to the Godzilla franchise. This is shown well by Godzilla's frightening new and deep roar. Aside from the roar and themes, the dark tones also carry over into a soundtrack for the movie that is emotionally gripping. The Japanese version of the film was changed heavily before the US release in ways that were disappointing to the fans. The US release was a full 16 minutes shorter and features more humor that was not received well. One shining aspect of the US release was the return of Raymond Burr's Steve Martin. The film of course was about Godzilla's return, but part of the main plot is that the King's return ramped up Cold War tensions between the Soviet Union and the United States, leaving Japan in the crossfire as they attempted to deal with Godzilla. It was confirmed in 1991's Godzilla vs King Ghidorah that this was not the same monster from 1954.